Six extraocular muscles control movement of the eye. They each have a primary, secondary and tertiary movement. The diagram for this video, we have to imagine we're looking at the patient's right eye. With the medial and lateral recti, the primary movement for the medial is to adduct the eyeball and for the lateral rectus to abduct the eyeball. These muscles do not have a secondary or tertiary movement. For the superior and inferior recti, the primary movement for the superior is to elevate the eye and for the inferior rectus to depress the eye. The secondary movement for the superior is to intort and for the inferior rectus to extort the eyeball. And both recti have a tertiary movement to adduct the eyeball with their slightly more medial attachments. Looking at the superior and inferior oblique, the primary movement for the superior is to intort the eyeball and the inferior will extort. The secondary movement for the superior is to depress the eyeball and for the inferior oblique to elevate. And the tertiary movement for the obliques is to work together to abduct the eyeball with their slightly more lateral attachments.